without any further ado, please welcome to Blocks class. They're called The Crew! <laughs> To the, to the line, y'all. Tonight's cast, we have Colleen Woo! Conrad Woo! Cynthia Owen and Robert We're going to start out with a, with a game called Conducted Story. It's for all the players. We're going to create a new story for you based on your suggestions. Uh, in the chat, put in an animal. I'll come back for that in just a moment. So the story that we're gonna that we're gonna create for you is called the blank and the blank. The first blank, give me a profession. Who's got a profession? Uh, dentist. Dentist. Perfect. I heard dentist first. And in the chat, who, what do we have? Ocelot. <laughs> the dentist and the ocelot. This is a brand new story we're gonna be hearing from today. The way it works, I'm gonna point at one of the players. Whoever I'm pointing at is gonna start the story. Uh, whenever I feel like it, I'm going to switch off to another player. They have to pick up mid-sentence, mid-word, mid-thought, and continue the same story until we figure out the whole of the story, and then we'll be done. So, I'm going to grab a chair because my knees ain't what they used to be. All right. You all ready? Yes! We have the story of the dentist and the ocelot. Otto the ocelot was swimming peacefully through the stream, munching on assorted mussels and clams. <laughs> ouch! Ouch! said Otto, when he crunched on a particularly crunchy clam. Whatever will I do? If I can't eat the clams, I will starve to death. Uh, luckily, Otto the ocelot knew a dentist that was a friend of his brother's uh, from way back in a college. So Otto the Ocelot called up his dentist and said, I have a toothache, may I come in? And the dentist said no, that he was closed that day. So Otto had to figure out something else to do about this tooth. Fortunately, Otto heard that they had really good Ocelot dentists in Mexico, and he wasn't too <laughs> far away. So he swam across the border and found Jose, the Mexican dentist, who tied a string around his tooth and said, if you'll just swim over that waterfall, <laughs> it'll pull your tooth out just fine. Oh my, he said, that waterfall looks quite scary, but I need this tooth out because I have problems eating clams. So off the waterfall he went, and he went to the bottom, and he found some clams right after his tooth had come out. <laughs> But then the rest of his teeth fell out, <laughs> and he had to go to the the oral surgeon to, to create him to create some some new teeth for him, some implants, mm. and it was really really expensive. And Otto's Otto the ocelot didn't really have much money, because really they don't have currency in the ocelot world. <laughs> he thought, how can I pay for my surgery? Fortunately, Otto also realized that if Mexico was cheaper, if he just kept going south, it would keep getting cheaper, so he got to the bottom of Chile where it was free. And see. <laughs> <laughs> 